What's happening, everyone? I just figured I'd do me a quick video. Um, it's gonna be pretty quick. Uh, it's wrestling time. Uh, well, here in a half hour, I know. I guess I, I guess I'm a nerd, but you know, gotta go see the same old, same old bullshit every week. You know, what are you gonna do? It's one of those things you watch since you're a kid, and you just, I don't know, you watch it anyways. But anyways, uh get to you guys a quick trade video here uh, did a nice little trade with um, Ed Olsentron I hope I said your name right buddy um, I don't know uh, but anyhow uh, cool dude uh, easy trading um, he told me hey I can't it'll be a couple days I can't get the car sent out to you till Friday I said well that's cool man I'll get, I'll get yours out Wednesday I'm not worried so, sure shit, uh, everything's all good, uh, I got it in today, he said it'd be coming in Monday, it came in Monday, so, everything's cool, but, uh, anyways, he threw in a couple extras, uh, those weren't part of the trade, but these four were part of the trade, we'll start out with this, uh, Gulch Stepper here, I didn't have this variant, I have it in, you know, out of the pack, but, I don't have this variant, but, um, Let's see here, as you can see, blah, 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 yeah, those two. But, um, anyway, I got that one. Got a nice tea bucket. I was looking for this for a little while. I had probably about four or five of them when I was a kid, but, you know, it was so cool, I just opened it up. <laughs> Man, you know, that's what you do when you're a kid. When you got stuff you like, you open it up. And we got this, um, this Delivery Classics, um, actually it's a, a 30th anniversary, it's not the, the original. I was gonna tell them not to worry about this one, and then I got thinking in my head, I'm like, wait, I don't even have that one. So, that's why it has the different style wheels, um, the older one still has, it has the bigger in the back and the smaller in the front. And the wheel design's just a shade bit different. I think they put all these ones on, like the Hot Wheels vintage and whatnot. But, yeah, 30th anniversary, got the little 30th anniversary badge on there. But still, all in all, cool car. I mean, like I said, I don't have it, so I was like, well, hell, I'm just trading an extra treasure hunt for it anyway, so why not add it to your collection? But now the only bad thing is, now I'm going to want the original one. But anyhow, this was the main thing that I wanted to do the trade for. Um, I love this car. I've been trying to find this variant for a long, long time. Um, well, you know, I, at flea markets and whatnot, I mean, yeah, if there's anything I want, I could just go on eBay, but it's just more fun in the hunt and finding it yourself, you know, whether it's through a trade or whether it's at the flea market or, well, you ain't gonna find blue cards on the pegs no more, but... Hey, you never know, maybe people are getting desperate for these new models, start trading them in. But, oh. Well, anyways, that's why I pulled this one back down off the wall. Because this is the variant that I had. I had the 7 star one. But, or the 7 spoke ones. But, I did not have, and I don't have the, the speed points. I noticed the rarer ones, they put the speed points on for some weird odd reason. But hey, cool beans. But, uh, yeah, I had this variant, and I had to have, I had to have this one. And a little bit of a Tampo slide, too. That's pretty cool. But, you know, nothing special, but I like it. Very nice trades, man. I appreciate it. Um, oh, I did read the note. The note was pretty sweet, man. Uh, yeah, hell yeah, I'll do some more trading with you, man. It was easy. You're close, man. It don't take too long. Within a couple of days, it's here. Vice versa on the same end on your end. But uh, anyways, let's get to these. Um, we got the running rig. Um, I have this in blue. I don't have it in white. I'll put it with that one. And um, I can't say I've ever seen this one. I'm not a real big Matchbox guy, but yeah, you know, I'll keep a hold of it. It's something I'm into. This thing, things pretty huge. I think I used the same wheels for my, my bare metal matchbox van that I polished out. But yeah, I think sweet. And then this cool one van. 
Um, I already have this one, but I'm going to keep this one. Just like you said, buddy, man, I don't know. I'm not going to trade uh, or give away, you know, ones that I get in a trade. So I'll swap this one out for the one that I have, and um, I'll give the other one to my buddy, because that's all he collects is strictly vans, and he don't have that one, so... I'll give him mine, and I'll put that one on my wall, because, you know, I appreciate you doing this trade with me, man, because, hell, you know, hey, we both don't know each other, and, you know, hey, everything went out super smooth, like, I, I can't complain, man. Uh, let's see here, I bought this turbo turret, uh, just kind of cool, it's just going to go in my extras box, I just wanted to have it, I guess. The same way with this graffiti ride. I've always had a fascination with graffiti. I hate blings. But, you know, what are you going to do? But I had to put that with my graffiti rides collection. And I picked this one up for my buddy in yellow. And he, I got the white one for him. Nothing special. I'm not even keeping it. Um, found this on the pegs. Track stars. Track ready. Uh, that'll go in the Kraken box for my next Kraken video. And then I picked up the nice white Super Snake. It's got the chrome wheels on it. I'm not sure what's going to be the rarest variant yet, but um, some MK's cars are showing up blue wheels. Some MK's cars are showing up chrome wheels. I've even heard race crews, I believe, say that, you know, hey, someone has... Um, blue wheels up in this part, some have chrome up in this part, and then I heard from another collector guy that I deal with at the flea market, and he said that a couple of his collector buddies found one with a blue wheel in the front and a chrome wheel in the back, so I don't know if that's going to be the ultra rare, hard to find one, or, you know, maybe it was like a one case deal, or maybe it's an, you know, um, a state's card or what, but I don't know. But anyways, I'll stop babbling. Um, yeah, buddy, I, I definitely appreciate the trade. Everything was good. Um, cards are all in good shape. Good packaging, man. It didn't bounce around, nothing. Um, I couldn't, couldn't ask for any better. Cool response, cool dude. I will do future trading with you anytime, man. As long as you got something I want, I'm willing to trade. Um, but anyways, I've babbled on long enough, man. Uh, peace out, guys. I'll get this video up tomorrow. I'll get a little link getting you to his channel. And, um, until then, man, uh, we'll talk to you next time.